Well, hello my friend, my name is Attila and this is Masterpiece. So this week there is nothing crazy going on. I'm just chilling at home on my holidays and uh, I made a silly little souvenir for myself and mostly just wanted to say hello and thank you for all of you. So let's just go downstairs and show you what I done and hope you stick around. Sawdust everywhere! Mustard piece. So today I am going to make a simple jigsaw puzzle of the woodworkers, if you will, with a little bit of twist if I'm brave enough. Let's start it. So first of all, let me wish every single one of you Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I hope you are all doing well and I appreciate you sticking with me and for that, thank you very much. So masterpiece is red and yellow. So we do red and yellow. Okay, I think it has set. Now let me try to take it out of the mold. So it's set nicely in 24 hours. I'm wondering if I could cut it into half because it, this is obviously way too thick for a jigsaw puzzle. If I can cut it into half I will have two of these. Let's try to do it on the lathe. That's not going to work. I have to push in the parting tool way too far to be safe. So, and I wouldn't gain a lot from it. Just that much. So, I probably just chisel away all the excess. Let's do that. So the bottom side is flat, now I am probably going to use my router to flatten the top side. It's much easier this way than doing it on the lathe. So because of the burr I have lots of holes in it where the epoxy couldn't get to so if I want to engrave anything into this one I need to put a flood coat on it, epoxy flood coat. So 
So now the question is, am I arrogant enough to think I will be able to engrave my logo into the finished piece pretty much for the first time and think it will look good? And the answer is yes, I am arrogant enough to try that. And I think that's a good thing. So since I started this whole thing, this is my attitude. I have this can-do attitude and more often than not, I will find a solution to, to make something that looks kind of impressive or at least looks good. I think not trying it and being afraid of failure is pretty much worse than failing. So just to be perfectly clear what's going on here, if I mess this one up bad, there will be no video uploaded on Christmas Day, so I am going to miss a week. But I am less afraid of not being able to upload a video than not being able to develop my skills. I will go ahead and try this. Wish me luck. I think that is good enough, however it's very difficult to see. So I am going to mix up a little bit of black colored epoxy and just pour it into and then we clean it up and that's when I will be able to assess whether it was a success or a fail. But it's looking alright. I am going to use the template and just stick it here, back, back side, but probably with much Podge. I'm not sure if that's the correct thing to do, but that's what I have and that's what I'm going to do. So now I have to cut the jigsaw puzzle pieces out of that board. I could use this one, but I have only used this tool once and it has to be really precise. So I kind of chickened out using this and I am probably just going to use a hand tool. Let's try this. Mustard piece. Thank you.